Welcome back to Quest Field. Hi again, everyone. Tony Ventrella, SoundersFC.com. Saturday, 12 noon, right here. San Jose Earthquakes against Sounders FC. Sounders coming off a win in New York. San Jose coming off three shutouts in a row. They tied New England nil-nil, but beat New York prior to that 4 nothing. This is a team on a streak, which is good, because last season they gave up 50 goals. They've turned things around this year. They uh, were disappointed with, with the last year or two, and um, oh, yeah. they've been making some moves and, and are trying to you know, reap the benefits. They've, they have an athletic team. They've got some good speed, some, some, some good size, and uh, you know, they're, they're doing all right. And um, you know, we're hopefully in the process of turning that corner that I've talked about for weeks, and, and I'm very happy with the result in New York, and now it's time for us to get back home and, and continue that process. San Jose keeper Joe Cannon has a streak of three shutouts in a row, but he's had plenty of help, too. Well, they're playing good team defense. You know, everyone's working for each other, and uh, goalkeeper has been great so far this year. You know, all of that um, ties together is going to, you know, give you a good run, and, uh, and that's what they've been doing so well this year. And, you know, you have to give um, tap your hat to those guys. Um, you know, when you, once you get the work on the field, it does, definitely you get the dividends paid off, and uh, that's what happened for them. Marshall is likely to mix it up a bit with former Jamaican national teammate Ryan Johnson Saturday. Will they talk on the pitch? Yeah, we, we do talk a little bit on the pitch sometimes, you know, say, hey, watch out, I'm going to come at you, or, you know, he's going to say, hey, take it easy, or, you know, so yeah, there's a little dialect that goes on the pitch, but it's friendly dialect, you know, um, you know, we try not to be too much into each other's ears, uh, we try to worry about our, each team and, you know, worry about our position and what we need to do, and obviously he's going to try to score, and I'm going to try to prevent him from scoring, so definitely it's going to be a challenge, and, uh, you know, hopefully I'm, I'm up to that challenge come Saturday. Coming off to win in New York, the Sounders have a chance to rebound in front of the hometown fans after a loss to L.A. here two weeks ago. You know, we were obviously very disappointed with the result against L.A. here. You know, the whole team top to bottom, and um, we're happy to get the result in New York for them. Uh, and just got to keep uh, giving them what they deserve. I mean, they give us everything every every game, whether home and away. Um, you know, you could see them in New York. I think 60 yeah, to 100 were. strong, and uh, they were loud, you know, just as loud as the New York fans. So they're they're unbelievable, and we hope to give them a win tomorrow. Casey Keller is impressed with San Jose's three clean sheets in a row, but he doesn't expect the earthquakes to stay back and protect. I think they're going to come in and uh, and really try to take it to us. You know, they're going to know that we're uh, still smarting a little bit from our last home result, and they want to you know try to see if they can shake us up a little bit and. You know, we've obviously gained some confidence keeping a clean sheet in New York, but at the same time, you know, we need to to know that, you know, can we win a game 3-2? Can we win a game, you know, 4-3, you know, even? And uh, that if we can come back from a goal down, you know, those were things that we did last year extremely well, and we haven't quite... Uh, we haven't quite got there yet. For Freddie Lundberg, San Jose's three shutouts in a row are fine, but it doesn't change the way his own team needs to play. This team, I think the important thing is we concentrate on our own game. Um, you play an opponent and uh, maybe it's cocky about how I'm used to or taught in Europe. It's about your game. If you play, you can play a great opponent, but if you play better, you win the game. That's what you need to concentrate about. And, uh, and, and that, that's what I hope we can, uh, you know, we can do. Last season, Seattle took two out of three overall against San Jose, but this year the Earthquakes are a better team. I think Frank's done a good job. You know, he's got the team believing in itself, and uh, and their team's playing better. They're you know defensively, they've been very compact and tight uh, in terms of how they've played. Uh, you know, their back four, they've, with the exception of Opara being in and out, they've had a pretty consistent back four now, uh, with Hernandez and with Leach and with Corrales and Burling has stepped in and played well. Um, you know, they uh, they uh, you know get eight guys back a lot of times, nine guys behind the ball, so they make it difficult for you to break them down so so defensively they've been very solid they've kept themselves in games and uh, you know and they've come up with timely goals when they've needed them once again match time Saturday here at Quest Field 12 noon San Jose against Sounders FC I'm Tony Ventrella SoundersFC.com <laughs>